Uh, this is Monday, May uh, 16th, the night after the total lunar eclipse. The moon is just rising now. Uh, this is just before 11 p.m. And this is the passage of the latest Starlink group launched three days ago. They were visible on three nights. This is the third night. First night very closely bunched together, uh, although I miss seeing that but from reports I saw from this area. And then last night I did manage to see them uh, very bright through the cloud, thin cloud, uh, at the eclipse site out of Cypress Hills and uh, didn't get a chance to shoot them. And it would, they were so bright at that time, they were showing up through the cloud. They must have been first magnitude. They're supposed to be three and a half tonight and maybe that looks about right. And that they're just visible, well, easily visible to the naked eye, but certainly not brilliant uh, tonight. So they faded quite a bit in the one day. And they're supposed to disappear at around Spica, fade out according to the heavens above plot, and Spica's just to the left, and that seems to be what they're doing. I'll keep it going because sometimes there's another bunch behind of stragglers. But I don't see any. They're still going on the video. So it's picking them up quite well. And I'm shooting at ISO 50, 1,200, one eighth of a second with the Venus Optics uh, 15 mil uh, wide open at F2. And shooting a time lapse with the 15 to 35 on the RA, uh, three second exposure, one second interval um, at ISO 6400, I think. And that looks like that's about it. So the plot in heavens above was, was accurate. And that's what I based my framing on.